so hi friends so the second shift of march 17 exam of j 2021 has been done now so i am here with the students the action expected cut off that is the analysis of the paper so i have got many feedback from the student about the uh, difficulty level of the paper so i will uh, talk about that here and also about the difficulty level of the paper subject wise and overall difficulty and i will compare the difficulty level of the exam with previous paper and previous attempt that is j5 attempt so if you are first to my channel please subscribe it you will get the similar analysis for the next day also and for next attempt also and i have already made many videos on nit cutoff that is category wise so if you are from any category male female home state other state all type of information and cutoff will be there so please check out those videos and if you haven't subscribed please subscribe the channel it will be very useful for you because i will provide all the information at the right time to you so let's start the video so here is the analysis of the paper that is bath 17 second shift so first of all the question we are from every topic as i am repeating this statement in my every analysis video because nta always try to focus on covering all the syllabus so if you prepare 50 percent syllabus or 70 percent syllabus no matter you will get question so the instruction we are given to each question that is if you have done any type of mistake in five attempt about the integer type question then don't worry you will get instruction before each in integer type question that how you should uh, put the answer so you can uh, put the answer in the correct format so you don't have to regret later for that and uh, the question we are from the expected topic as i said in my video that i have made that is expected easy topic uh, from the topic the easy question will be asked so if you haven't watched that video please watch and prepare accordingly because you will get the easy question from that topic and it will be easy to solve so that you can increase your marks also that will that if you watch that video and do accordingly your marks will be increased by 30 to 40 marks now come to the paper the first of all i will talk about the chemistry subject uh, that is chemistry was ncrt based but it was tricky as is the case of second shift of every attempt from the fab itself and uh, yesterday also the chemistry was tricky for the second shift but in first shift chemistry was the easiest among all but this in second shift chemistry was little tricky that makes it uh, a moderate level paper so around 15 question we are asked from the ncrt book directly so if you don't uh, study the ncrt book please try to focus on that because from inorganic and last three to four chapter there will be direct question from ncrt so it makes the chemistry moderate uh, not easy as as uh, it is the case of in uh, almost every shift chemistry was easy but uh, in, in this time chemistry was moderate so in physics every topic have a question and especially uh, conceptual and theory based questions so if you prepare your notes during your preparation it will be very useful for you to and that will give you the uh, marks in the examination hall so try to repeat the notes itself because the notes will uh, uh, memorize the concept and theory based on the chapter so you can uh, easily score good marks in the physics subject particularly so uh, the, as i got the uh, feedback from the student uh, some students said it was e very easy but some said it was moderate so you can say it was easy to moderate level paper for the physics now uh, come to the math math also have some easy question from the topic such as permutation combination uh -huh. 3d geometry and relation function and mathematical reasoning so these are the topic which will contain the easy question but math was among the hardest of the three as uh, it was case of every shift so uh, you can say so math was moderate to hard so now if you talk about the overall difficulty level of the paper so overall difficulty is moderate neither easy nor hard but the last day's second shift was moderate to hard that is tougher than this shift so you can expect the cutoff for this shift will be something higher than the last day second shift but it will surely high uh, lower than the first shift of the today so if you compare it with the fab attempt so it is harder than the fab attempt of the corresponding shift so you can say uh, the march attempt exam is little uh, tougher than the fab attempt so it will affect the cutoff also and marks versus percentile also so now if you talk about the expected cutoff that is category wise i have talked about the march uh, session so you can check that video also in the i button as well as in the description box you will get the link there i have talked about the expected marks versus percentile for the march session i have uh, assumed the toughness of the march session will be higher than the fab session so i have made that video so you can check that video you will get both the thing marks versus percentile and also 
uh, about the expected uh, category cutoff that is from SC, ST, OBC or AWS if you are belong if you belong from any category you will get the information there so this is all about the analysis of the paper that is second shift of March 17 and I have already made many videos uh, like percentile versus your category rank so that you can estimate the um, college that you um, can get at your percentile so uh, that video will give you the category rank and that is used to estimation of the NIT triple IT or any branch uh, that, that you can get and uh, that also I have talked about this through many videos that is all an IT CS cutoff, all an IT EC cutoff, all triple IT cutoff, GFT cutoff. So I have already made many videos so check those videos and if you haven't subscribed please subscribe the channel so that you will get the further videos also on this channel and I will inform you about everything and if, and you, if you have any doubt you can ask in the comment section or you can join uh, to me through Instagram or you can also join the WhatsApp group you will get both the link in the description box so thanks for watching this video.